Hello everyone. Today's lesson is on formatting numbers in a merge field. And if you want to format prices um, with a numeric picture switch is what we're actually doing here. So I'm going to give you the um, written information along with the, my demonstration. So um, what you're, the first thing you're going to do is go to your word merge and then create a new document and it will link it to wherever you've chosen in your in your uh, access. In this case I chose the Smithfield um, query and I click on OK. And then what it does at that point is it opens your Word document and it, from here I can insert my mail merge fields. fields. The first thing I want to do is to just insert information that refers to what I'm talking about. Okay, this is just kind of telling you what the symbols mean that I'm going to be using. I'm going to be using um, the slash and then a pound sign and that just begins the switch. Okay, and then um, whatever characters I use and then it's going to have a comma. So it's going to be a setup like that and that your commas to designate thousands and then I'm going to have the zero placeholders to indicate that you want to include a decimal place a point to two places with each number. Okay, so here I go. I'm going now my database is associated with this document so you can keep this in front of you but I'm going to insert my merge field. So I have my first name and next and my salary. Now the next step is to right click and it tells you right here um, you're going to right click the field to toggle to the field codes. Now we have the field codes and see how it's similar to this step number two and this is where I start my switch. I go back, pound, and it is um, space, dollar sign, comma, pound, zero, zero. Okay, now let's take a look at that, that when I go into preview my results. And there you go. Everything's all set up and that's how you uh, format your numbers to, to import. It'll work, this fe feature will work with Excel and it'll also work with Access when you're merging into Word. So that gives you a uh, basics, the basics, and I hope you're all having a good day.